My name is Professor John Polak. Uh, I'm with the Centre for Transport Studies at Imperial College London. And uh, by background, I'm a mathematician and I've been working in the area of economics and engineering and the interface between those two now for the best part of 30 years. Um, you're involved in Celsius and you have a quite big task there. Could you tell me a little bit more about that? Our role, our principal role in Celsius is to help the project to understand how best, best to bring together uh, innovations in technologies of various sorts with uh, an understanding of the way in which those technologies will be adopted and used by users in order to design the best way of deploying those technologies into a range of new applications. For example, addressing some of the problems associated with managing peak loads in urban networks. Yeah. Do you think it will be an easy task to solve this, or do you see any obstacles in the way? It's not easy. If it was easy, then someone would have done it already. But I think we've got a tremendous team of researchers, uh, both at Imperial and in our other partners in the project. And I think we've got a super collection of public authorities and industrial interests and if we all are able to work together effectively, then I'm sure we'll be able to demonstrate success. It's a four-year project. What's your expectations after the project? Well, I mean, in best of worlds, what would you like to see after the, um, when the day Celsius is done? I think at two levels I have ambitions. Firstly, and I think most importantly from the point of view of the, of the project itself and the sponsors, I think we want to be able to look back on both successful demonstrations in the existing Celsius cities and uh, the recruitment of new cities for whom we can demonstrate the Celsius concept has relevance and value. And the more successful we are, the more cities will be attracted. But also, uh, as an academic and a researcher, I think I should like to see us make some significant progress in understanding and in uh, addressing some of the technical challenges in achieving that success in the market. And if we can do that, if we can be successful in addressing the technical challenges that unlock uh, some of the potential that we've been discussing here, then I think that will make me a, a happy man at the end of four years. All right. Thank you very much.